So uh, you're going to want to brace yourself real quick, George, because I have something that's going to get you excited. Mm. The Jonas Brothers are coming to Broadway. Oh. Wait, before I get too excited, <laughs> is it the actual Jonas Brothers or like people pretending to be the Jonas Brothers? Oh, well, I'd assume Jess knew it was the real Jonas Brothers and isn't spreading fake news. But they announced a five-night Broadway residency. And is it going to be like a concert? See, the bullet point doesn't it's go wrong. <laughs> no, 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 no. Shut up. I'll tell both of you guys. <laughs> let me break this down for you guys and let me make this very fucking simple. Okay. I am the biggest Jonas Brothers fan. We know. Ever. Now people are like, what? Jonas Brothers? Shut up. <laughs> Pussy. I compare them to the Beatles. Stop. I compare them to Earth, Wind, and Fire. Right there. Shut up. Kanye wishes he has All the right, stage performance just, of the Jonas fun, Brothers. Huh? I'm hot. You're cold. See that, like the air. The, you go around like you know. That was honestly fire. Yeah, I practiced <laughs> every day in my closet because I couldn't practice in my bedroom because if my All parents the other Jonas heard me, they'd, Brothers fans are also they'd get mad at me. But listen, let me let me get back to the real thing. Do you know when the Jonas Brothers even found out that they were famous? They were filming Camp Rock, and they came back to perform at a concert, and then they realized that the crowd is singing they're singing back to them what kind of magical shit is that what kind of fairy tale shit is that that you don't know you're famous until the crowd is singing your songs back to you i want to be at this show it's very magical and if you know anybody how many knows heard don't interrupt me when story. i'm when i'm talking about the jonas brothers because that will be the last straw in this relationship george has told me this story with like conviction many if the times. jonas brothers came up to me right now and they're like listen bro <laughs> you get to get front row tickets, but you can't bring Bell. I'll be like, who's Bell? Who's Bell? I would never stand in your way to who's go see the Bell? Jonas Brothers. Bell? I don't know, Bell. <laughs> Put me front row. I'll be the guy starting this shit. <laughs> it's called a wave. Um, As you guys know, I'm a huge Jonas Brothers fan. So if you Jonas Brothers are out there and they're listening to this and they're like, yo, we really like that guy who talks about Jesus on Impulsive. Remember, you started Christian, guys. You wore the freaking the thing where you couldn't fuck around, and, and you would. I always supported that shit. All the people at school were like, oh, look, you Jonas Brothers can't bone. I go, but you can't bone because you can't. They can't bone because they don't want to. I was standing up for you guys. I was standing up for you guys. When people were like, did you watch their shit TV show? I go, excuse fucking me, okay? Do you have a TV show, bitch? No. Do you have a TV show? I don't think no. so. The only thing I watch you do is act like an idiot. And then I oh. fucking mic dropped and just mm. left. Get George to the Jonas Brothers on Broadway. That's all I ask. I ask to just, you know, even if I can't make it, just like a hug. If I see you guys, I just want a hug. Or, or honestly, I'll give you guys my real fantasy. And this is like something I've actually pictured, right? <laughs> I'm, I'm at the bar with my girlfriend. We're taking shots. I'm throwing them back like a man, Ooh. right? No chasers because I don't need that. Mm. She looks shit. at me and she goes, this is the greatest night of my life. And then I go, you know what, baby? It's about to get better. Mm. And then I get on my hands and knees and I ask her to marry me. And then she looks at me and she's like, oh my God, yes. And then we're crying. We're like, this day can't get better. We're at a karaoke spot and we're just having a great time. How many and times have you thought about this? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> and then all of a sudden they're like, who wants to go up next? And I'm just feeling it, right? I'm feeling it. And I'm like, you know what? I want to fucking sing. I want to sing right now because I'm in love. And they're like, all right, go ahead. And then they're like, what song? I go, shut up. The year 3000. <laughs> One day when I came home, that I don't want to get demonetized, right? And right. then all of a sudden, some, some dudes at the bar turns around and I make eye contact and then it's, it couldn't be. It's Nick. And Nick's like, stop, stop. And then they stop. They're like, do you mind if, if I sing with you? I go, Nick. This would be the greatest, only if you, and right before I even finished, the brothers, I'm like, <gasps> no way. They're surrounding you, George. Surrounding me, and now it's the Jonas Brothers plus George Janko. You're the fourth brother? Well, they have a fourth brother, but. I know he's much younger, but he's not part of the band. Yeah, but don't disrespect him because he's equally important, okay? Okay, you're the fourth brother. Thank you, thank you. Because if they watch band. this and they think that you're disrespecting their brother like that, and I miss my chance I'm not on getting on stage. I know he has like just blondish hair. Their, no, he doesn't. Okay. Doesn't he have like light brown hair or something? He made an appearance in their show. Okay, continue, continue, continue. You're you're the fourth honorary brother, not excluding <laughs> their other fourth brother. <coughs> Go on. And we sing 3000, the year 3000. And then after that, they're like, dude, do you mind? If, if you want, do you want to sing the SOS song? <laughs> like, <laughs> 
this is an asterisk. And okay, and then that's the that's the rest of the night. Mm. I, that would be the highlight of my night. Even I, asking you to marry me wouldn't have been the highlight of my night. It would have been singing alongside the Jonas Brothers. That hurts a little. But um, <laughs> if I could make that happen for you, I would. Listen, if you could make that happen for you, I would make it happen for you that I'd carry your baby like a seahorse in my body. <laughs> I don't know if they do that. Did the seahorses do Definitely that? Definitely not, yeah, man. They don't do this, but the seahorse dads do carry the babies. Man, I'll carry that shit for you, bro. I'd, like Thank right you. here. <laughs> That's <it>. more realistic. <laughs> That's more realistic. <laughs> All right. If you guys liked that clip, go ahead and hit that link in my description and watch the full podcast. You will not regret it. Thanks for your support. Love you.